in the famous hadith of the Prophet and with this hadith we'll conclude as he's climbing the steps on the mimbar in front of hundreds and thousands of sahaba and each time he climbs he says ameen, ameen, ameen and then he turns around and he said I'll explain to you why I said ameen Jibreel came to me and he told me three things every time he told me one thing he said say ameen so I said ameen and the last one that he said was O Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa any person of your ummah who manages to catch a parent, in other words, whose parents live to a level of old age, and they still are not capable of having their sins forgiven and entering Jannah. In other words, if Allah blesses you with an elderly parent, and you still cannot earn Allah's pleasure, then may that person perish. In other words, in other words, if you have elderly parents, and you're not able to earn Allah's pleasure through them, you will not earn it through any other means. Say Ameen Ya Rasulullah. So the Prophet ﷺ said Ameen. Brothers and sisters, simple point. Bottom line, if your parents are alive, the only way to be a pleasing servant to Allah, the only way to be a good Muslim is to have your parents love you. If your parents are angry with you, if your parents are not happy with you, and you're not trying to change that situation, it doesn't matter what you do in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The parents have ultimate priority in this world.